Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Drive-By Reviews, where we're looking today at a solar motion sensor light. And this is probably one of the lowest cost motion sensor lights I've ever seen. Now, it's only 200 lumens, but it can stay charged for 12 hours of lighting time, as it says, with one day of sunlight. Now, I live in a cloudy part of the world, so we'll see how that works out. But uh, let's see what's inside the box. Bada bing, bada boom. And he said, let there be light if there was motion, and he saw that it was good. Well, there we have it, 12 LEDs. There's the motion sensor, here's our solar panel. Pretty simple. All right, there's our screw kit. We've got the uh, heat rock stays, some caps for the screws, and the screws themselves. So pretty straightforward here. Let's see, is there even an instruction manual? Oh, here's the usual manual. I found it. Okay, so in shipment, the battery is locked for safety. There's a key pin to click the on-off switch in the hole. Okay. Where's this key pin? Five is the on-off switch right there. Okay. Ah. Oh, it blinked at me. You know what that means. It's on. Oh, and there's the motion sense. Ha! Okay, I just want to show you real quick inside the brightness of this. So let's kill the lights and it'll turn itself on. And you can kind of see the 200 lumen brightness. So here's our brightness on the light. So not insanely bright, but definitely illuminating a large area. It's very widespread. And here's my lamp light. So there's your difference. Lamp light. Solar light. Lamp light. Say about, about the brightness of the lamp light, just a very cool white compared to this nice warm one. All right, here we go to the backyard and install the light. And there we go, you'll see Screws right into wood, nice and easy. Don't even need the sheetrock stays if you're gonna use it in wood. There we go, nice and installed in the backyard fence. Now, here's some pictures at night to kind of demonstrate how it looks. This is with it on its brightest setting with the motion sensor activated. The brightness level isn't as bright as the picture appears. It's actually a little dimmer than this. And I would say this light, although not good for working on something detailed, is just about right when it comes to security and lighting up when someone walks by I let them know that there is a motion sensor there. Uh, beyond that, I'd say uh, not a bad purchase considering it's way under 20 bucks, under 15 bucks. A decent option to consider if you're in the market for a motion sensor solar powered light.